Hi, I'm Cheryl Wettstein with the Washington Times. Uh, Mr. Doherty, Professor Doherty, you're introducing a new idea of soft reasons for divorce. Uh, you mentioned growing apart, lack of communication. Uh, can you elaborate, please, on what you're talking about? Uh, on what I mean by the soft reasons? Yeah, the, 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 those things that are not about somebody behaving badly. Okay, and when I call the hard reasons, somebody is dysfunctional, somebody is gambling the family money away, somebody is abusing somebody, somebody is having a series of affairs. If you want to just use kind of lay language, there's something there that somebody is, is behaving dysfunctionally. Um, the um, uh, young couples now want to marry their soulmate. Uh, and if you look at these wedding show, these, you know, Bachelorette and these other sorts of shows, everybody wants to marry their soulmate. And, uh, uh, and, uh, and then a little while later, your soulmate, uh, you know, uh, watches the ball game or, or criticizes you or something like that. Uh, and, and so the, 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 the soft reasons are very much sort of uh, are culturally based in the sense that they are quintessentially mid-20th century and beyond educated uh, uh, you know, people with sort of the Western values or college-educated people in Asia and so on, who, who expect intimacy, expect to be uh, best friends. Uh, and, um, and my view is that we don't actually prepare people for the kind of marriage that we now expect in our society. Uh, for men and women to be uh, a, a good friends and uh, confidants and have equal gender roles and all that is a very big thing if you look at the history of marriage. Uh, and uh, when we don't live up to that in a culture where we see marriage as a, a consumer lifestyle um, to get my needs met, uh, then w w we move on. Can I? I'd like to just add one thing. In the judiciary, we call the hard reasons the three A's. That's addiction, abuse, or affairs. Just to, you know, judges can be practical. So <laughs> addiction, <laughs> abuse, or affairs, and everything else pretty much was soft reasons. Not, not, but just generally speaking, okay?